Hey YouTube, welcome to, well, I should say, my first vlog, or discussion. To be honest, I hate vlogging, I hate talking, because on here, if I'm talking, I sound like a freaking kid. I mean, come on, I'm 23 years old and I sound like I'm, I sound like I'm two. Don't you just hate that? I mean, it's cool when I'm doing my voices, you know, I do voices like this, or like this. Or like this. I like this. Man, it sounded like Smeagol. Well, anyway, getting off topic here. Uh, I wanted I wanted to do a discussion video. Because I wanted to ask y'all a question. How many of you, show of hands, believe in the paranormal? Hmm? Well, obviously I do. I've had a lot of experiences with the paranormal. So many. Uh, my first one, I'd say, began when I was, when I was a baby, you know. I, I was born prematurely, died three times. No joke, no joke. Uh, seriously, I did die three times. I was born prematurely, had a collapsed lung, yada, yada, yada. They used that freaking shocker machine to get me back to life which freaking didn't which freaking work because of course I'm here you know and those doctors that worked on my mom that work that brought me into this world were kind of bungholes you know excuse me I don't I don't actually cuss um in other words they were kind of jerks because they were telling my mom that they would tell my mom if I live that would be a freaking vegetable I mean do you see me being a vegetable do you see do you see me of course, they were wrong, as you can see. That 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 that. Well, anyway, I'm getting off topic. Well, well, yeah. Well, anyway, yeah. I had a Lazarus phenomenon, which people call it. I uh, got I got to see heaven, but can't describe it because it's like so good that you can't actually talk about it. Um, another few things that I've dealt with uh, in the paranormal. In other words, I used to live in um I used to live in Mission, Mission, Texas, in in Shrine. Oh no. Oh, far. It was far. Uh, we had a mobile home. And uh, for some reason, in my room every night when I go to sleep, I, would always, I had a habit of always shutting my closet door for some reason. I was in middle school at the time. So don't judge me, okay? Don't judge me. Uh, and I would go to sleep. I didn't have a bed in the room because I didn't have a bed, period. And I would sleep on the floor and in my room. And every night when the closet door would shut, I would wake up in the middle of the night. I had a habit of waking up every night in the middle of the night. I don't know why. Um, well, I would get up and the door would actually open as if somebody was turning the knob and literally opening it, but slowly like a, like an eerie horror flick, like somebody's hiding in the closet or something, you know? First, I brushed it off like it was nothing, you know? But then, here's the freaky part. God uh, used my mom it's because she was, we're, I'm a Christian, I'm a, I'm a devoted Christian, my whole family is practically, and my mom is really, really, really devoted more, uh, honestly more than me, I mean, don't get me wrong, I'm a, I'm a Christian, I love the Lord with all my heart, you know, he's my father, he's like a father to me, he's been there all my life, but like my mom, she gets really into it, when she's praying, she gets really into it, and God just takes over, well, anyway, he, he took over, and uh, he went, in every room of of that house prayed like crazy and he was cleaning out everything that wasn't right any any bad mojo any evil spirit that was trying to hide in the house he cleansed it and the funny thing is i thought he wasn't gonna come in my room and i was still asleep i was barely like up but then he came in he came in and he opened my closet door and he literally it looked like a freaking spiritual battle royale you know, I could literally see him fighting the thing. And I, I stayed under the covers. I didn't know what the heck was going to go on. You know? And also, another thing happened. One time, while we were still in that house, uh, I woke up and I wanted to get a glass of water. But for some reason, I, I could hear... Uh, again, I'm not crazy, okay? I don't care if you think I am or you think I'm not, okay? I'm telling you the truth here. You know, I'm not good at talking. 
I hate vlogging. Anyway, anyway, back to my story. Um, well, I was gonna get up to get a glass of water, but for some reason, I felt like I shouldn't. You know, if I got up, something bad was gonna happen. You know, uh, but like I really, really wanted to get up, but for some reason, I stayed there. You know, and that's basically all that happened in that house.